Today's question comes from Damien from the blogosphere. Damien asks, if someone buys a text link from my website, I add the nofollow tag so you know it's a paid link. Should I do the same for banner images also? In general, whenever you're talking about banner ads, the vast majority of those are sold via ad exchanges or uh, you know various advertising networks, which already will do uh, block out bots because they don't want bots crawling their their banner ads. They don't want bots blog. Uh, they don't want bots messing with their impressions or click counts or anything like that. So if you're using any sort of standard advertising banner ad package. Uh, most of the time, those redirects will go through things that are blocked by robots.txt or that somehow are, are not really crawlable by search engines. And so that's perfect. You don't need to worry about it in that case. If you are directly selling a link yourself, and it, the only difference is one is an image versus one is a, a text link, if someone paid for it specifically, then uh, yes, I would put a nofollow on the link even if it's an image link. Uh, but again, for most cases, Google handles the, the typical banner ad and all those sorts of stuff very well so that they don't flow page rank and you know things are handled appropriately. And, uh, and so if that's the case, then I wouldn't worry about that situation.